Pambazo, pambaso, is the name of a Mexican white bread. It is also the name of the dish or antojito, very similar to the torta, made with this bread dipped in a red guajillo pepper sauce and filled with papas con chorizo, potatoes with chorizo. The bread used for pambasos is white and lacks a crispy crust. This particular bread is made of flour, lard, eggs, and is tougher and drier than the similar bolillo, also used for sandwiches, which allows it to retain its shape while being soaked in sauce. Pambasos are usually found in Mexican bakeries where they are sold just as any other white bread. However, since its exterior surface is a bit dry and fragile, is usually reserved for other uses than a meal's companion. It is unclear since when or why the pambazo is prepared and filled in a very specific way. While other similar dishes change the fillings or toppings, the pambazo recipe remains almost the same. The bread is first filled with the potato and chorizo, then dipped in warm red guajillo pepper sauce, which gives the bread its famous orange-red sprinkled coloration. Once the bread has been soaked, it is passed on to fry in a bit of oil. The pambazo is to fry on the top and bottom of the bread. The pambazo is ready whenever the bread being fried becomes crispy on both sides. It is then garnished with shredded lettuce, salsa, sauce, crema, cream, and queso fresco, fresh cheese. In the Mexican state of Veracruz, the pambazo, the bread, after some proofing the buns are punched in a bed of wheat flour and then back to proofing and baked. Once the bread is ready the top remain dusted and is sliced to the filling of layered gridded refried black beans with chorizo, shredded lettuce, sliced chipotle peppers in adobo, ground or squared queso blanco or queso fresco and spread mayonnaise. From food stands to backpacks or school lunch boxes the sandwich is wrapped in napkins to gently avoid dusted fingers, nose and lips. In other regions is filled with ham or Polish meat. At birthday parties, parties or social events, small-sized pambasos are served instead of canapes. These are known as pambasitos, which literally means, little pambazo. History The pambazo bread got its name from the Ladino word pan basso, Spanish pan bajo, or low-class bread from Mexico. S. Viceregal period. During that period, there were bakeries in Mexico dedicated solely to this type of bread named Panbasarias, Pambasarias. On this type of bread, inferior quality flour or flour from deteriorated wheat were mixed to produce the pan basso. Bakeries produced minimal quantities of pan basso, a maximum of 4% of all flour in Mexico City. Virginia Garcia Acosta, Las Panaderias, Sus Dueños y Trabajadores. Ciudad de México, Siglo XVII. Varieties State of Mexico In some villages from State of Mexico, the pambasos are made with Semitic Mediterranean cuisine influence by the use the Asamite or brand for bread made in artisan bakeries about horns of Spanish colonial period, as the case of Malinalco, Takixquiac and Amicamica. In Malinalco, State of Mexico makes other pambasos, a Spanish colonial meal or made flour more small to Mexico City pambasos, filled with sausage and potatoes, chicken meat with epizote, shredded lettuce, white cheese, cream and spicy salsa. In Tequixquiac, State of Mexico makes pambasos very different to Mexico City, are made flour with dark wheat rind or bran named asamite, filled with sausage and potatoes, turkey meat or lamb meat, barbacoa, shredded lettuce, white cheese, cream and spicy chili chipotle sauce, fried with butter. The name is registered in this place as pan bazo, an archaic Spanish word. State of Puebla in Puebla City, pambasos are made with flour in the bread named semita or asamite, filled with sausage and potatoes, avocado, papalo, white cheese, cream and with red spicy salsa on the pambazo. State of Veracruz In Orizaba, Veracruz, an important place with Sephardic roots, is made of pambazo with pole meat, is mixture with traditional pambazo or asamite, Polish beef meat and lettuce, with spicy sauce. Reception The Daily Meal reviewed the pambazo with 
It's insanely delicious. In their article, 12 Life-Changing Sandwiches You've Never Heard Of. See also List of Mexican dishes Food portal Notes References De Carraza, Laura B. 1991. El Libro Clásico de la Cocina Mexicana. Mexico, D.F. Promexa. ISBN 968-39-0366-5. Nieto, Blanca. Cocina Tradicional Mexicana. Mexico, Selector. ISBN 968-403-710-4. Flores, Carlos Arturo, 1990. México, La Cultura, El Arte y La Vida Cotidiana. Mexico, Centro de Investigaciones Interdisciplinarias en Humanidades, Coordinación de Humanidades, Universidad Nacional Autónoma de México. ISBN 968-36-0667-9. External links. Recipe